Today I start a new adventure, working at a local organic farm for my food as part of my CSA share. So here we go. First day working on the farm. CSA stands for Community Supported Agriculture. That means we buy a share of the farm. So when the farm does well, then we receive a huge bounty. When the farm doesn't do well, then we may receive less. What's actually sharing in what the farmers go through? I chose Monroe Organic Farms in Kersey, Colorado, a small organic farm of 60 acres that feeds over 600 families. My family and I are already huge fans of farmers markets. In fact, as soon as they open, we are there. But we wanted more to know about the community and community supported agriculture and what our local organic farmers go through. Eating local goes beyond just fresh food and even better taste. This has environmental impact as well. Our food doesn't travel as far, and we don't rely as much upon oil. Ready to work at the farm today. Me. Me. Honey. I need more coffee first. The best part was my whole family could come along and help out. My kids helped stuff the ingredients into the share bags and we all had a really great time doing it. It turned out to be one of the highlights of the summer for the kids and they keep on asking when can they go back to the farm. Now when I say that we worked on a farm, we certainly did, but it was no way in the hard work and early mornings that the farmers do every single day for us. We got to come into all this wonderful produce freshly picked that morning. And what we would do is put the amount of each shares in a bag. Now that on our day, just our day on Wednesday, we stuffed over 156 bags for the route, and that was just one of three days. If you're looking for an affordable way to get local, organic, fresh food, I highly recommend joining a CSA. After the bags were all filled, we loaded them into the trucks to be delivered. And let me tell you, if you need to build your muscles, work as part of your CSA. It's time to start hoeing. We would be out in the field doing whatever they needed done on the farm. We would pick basil, pull weeds, uh, go through and shed the skin on the onions uh, to make sure that they wouldn't rot for the coming year. Anything that needed done, we did, and it was absolutely amazing. I do want to mention that I really believe that the true benefit coming from working as part of our CSA share were the people that we worked with. We got to be there with the farmers themselves and the group of people that were there each week. We shared recipes, tips for storing, and just had a time to spend together talking. It was the true sense of community. And of course, not to mention all the amazing local organic fruits and vegetables we got all summer long. So right now as part of our share we get to pick tomatoes. So we get three boxes like this size. It's a lot of tomatoes and it's part of the share it's all included and uh, it's really awesome. We have homemade tomato sauce all year. So this is our CSA harvest for today, and this is just today. Next week we'll be back. As part of our harvest, we get to pick three boxes of tomatoes, which we did today. Uh, we got corn and leeks, potatoes, we have three muskmelon, a watermelon, Ethan helped, 
more tomatoes, zucchini, squash, beets, yellow tomatoes. That is a lemon cucumber. We got onions, peppers, two different types of eggplant, and green beans. So, like I said, this is just today. Last week we got quite a bit, and then uh, next week we'll be back for more. So, this is all stuff that not only will we be eating, um, so this week all we have to do is buy some meat, and that's all we need from the grocery store. Uh, we don't need to buy anything else. Joe Salatin said, The first supermarket supposedly appeared on the American landscape in 1946. That's not a very long time ago. Until then, where was all the food, dear folks? The food was in homes, gardens, local fields and forests. It was near kitchens, near tables, near bedsides. It was in the pantry, the cellar, the backyard. I think it's time to return to that, to return to that simplicity, to support our farmer. Take responsibility for where our food comes from and what we put into our bodies. Well, my name is Laura Cruz, and I cannot wait for next season to work for my local food. <laughs>